Hey YouTube, it's Mitch at ModMy.com. Today we're going to be talking about the top five themes this week. Today's August the 17th. So let's go ahead and get started. The first one we're looking at here is called IE Sight. This is by the developer iPhone Eye Helper. He's well known for his other themes on Cydia called uh, I7 Us is one of them, I Black Us. He has several different awesome themes. You definitely want to check them out. This one here is very unique itself. Uh, it has over 280 different themed icons with three different sets of icons. You get a light version, dark version, and what he refers to as a clean version. So the, the, the one we're looking at here is the light version, if I'm not mistaken, yes. And it does include some iconomatic and some other things with it. So let's take a look at some of these icons you see here. They're very unique, to say the least. And this also comes included with 25 wallpapers. And you get all this for the grand total of $3.99. That may seem a bit pricey, but if you are an iPad user also, you will be getting an IE site iPad theme in approximately two weeks, I've been told. So, you know, if you buy one, you get the other one. So, you know, it's like buy one and get one free. So, pretty awesome to say the least. Uh, overall, guys, he's just put a lot of work in this. You know, like I said, 25 wallpapers alone would be worth $3.99. And here's one of those I've chosen to use for my lock screen. So, though, as well as the home screen here, that wallpaper behind my icons is coming from IE Sight. So, let's go in here to look at some of these wallpapers. You see, there's 25 different ones, and they start right there with that black IE Sight one. You see, I think that's where they start at, and you, they come all the way down through here. There's 25 different ones, guys. So, so you're definitely going to find ones you like, I'm sure and one for your lock screen to as well. So let's go ahead and take a look and run through these other uh, icons, see what they look like. Now, one other thing I do want to show you here, you do get a reboot screen, you see that IE site. There are a couple different ones as well as loading screens, you get those. So there's a lot that goes with this theme, guys, a lot working under the hood here. And this is referred to as the dark version, which is just more or less a little outline around each of the icons. You can see they still look basically the same. But okay, guys, this is the clean version here, and you can see that he's totally removed any of the outlines. There's no stroke around any of the icons. And to me, I personally prefer this one. So he's also themed the control center as you can see here it's got that ios 8 feel to it just everything's round i really like the way he's done this a phenomenal job and just overall a very nice looking theme guys definitely something you want to check out okay guys the second one we're looking at here is called sate i think is how you pronounce that and it says this is an italian word meaning seven so I'm taking it that he used seven different gradients and colors combined to come up with each icon. So it says it has a hundred themed icons and you also get one wallpaper optimized for the iPhone and iPad. Uh, so here's the one that he's chosen to use for his home screen. Personally, I don't prefer it, but to each their own. He has done a very nice job with each of these icons though. Uh, I will give him credit for that. I do like this. And overall, it's a very cool theme. And Sate is $1.50 and you can get it in the Mac City repo. So be sure and check it out. I think you'll really like it. It's got some pretty awesome cool icons and it's got a lot to offer. This one's called Harlequin and you can get it for $2.99 in the Mac City repo. Now guys, this is a pretty cool theme. What it does is keeps everything consistent all the icons that are themed blend with the icons that aren't themed such as that mx2 icon 
Okay, that's an icon that's not theme, but it still looks pretty nice in with the other icons as well as the doesn't look like the Amazon. But guys, this is a pretty awesome little thing for three bucks. I definitely recommend it. Check it out. It's called Harlequin. Okay, guys, this one's called Mandolino, and it's free. And what it does, it's an Italian developer, must be. You get 120 different icons themed, settings app icons, lock screen chevron, message chevron, and much more. So let's take a look at it. As you can see, what he has done is use some very like light colors with a very small glyph in the center of each icon to theme each each individual icon but as you can see even the ones that aren't themed here again look fairly okay you know that mod my eye there sort of stands out a little bit me being a, such a large having such a large center icon but for the most part, they look pretty cool, guys. It is a free theme, and he said he would be updating it as time went by. So I say install it and keep checking on it. It looks pretty cool overall. Guys, this one is called Aramie. You see the new boot logo on the screen right there. I wanted to start it up as I was in, or, uh, activating the theme. So let's go ahead and take a look at it now. As you can see, this is the flat look and one that I really do like very much. I like this style of theme here. And you get several different things with it. Uh, let's go into the wallpaper here. You get your Aramie, your Aramie settings. You get a lock sound. If you have Jelly Lock 7 installed, you can use it. And Aramie boot logo. That's what we just saw earlier. And let's see if we get any type of loading screens. And I don't see any. So no the answer to that is no and it looks like he has themed these icons down the left side of the settings here but overall very cool theme it's very minimalistic and very clean look to it i really like it definitely one worth checking out don't forget guys thumbs up this video it really helps me out a great deal hit that subscribe button and keep coming back